I was two three checking out the top five guns here in Black Ops Cold War. Now we're literally at the end of this cycle. What is his name? You know what I'm saying. So I'm show you the official top five best guns in this game. Hands down, this is not no Pacific order. This is these top five guns here. So first one is the Tech Nine. When this thing first came out, it definitely was like OD. It's a little OD now, but it's not nothing too crazy from what it used to be after it got nerfed a couple times. So the class setup, obviously, it's the um, full auto repeater. The task force barrel, the field agent grip, the Stanag 39 round mag, and the airborne elastic right. So me and Tech Nine definitely one of the top one guns in the game, probably used, and definitely the, one of the best SMGs right now. Now for the second gun that's broken in this game, it's my personal favorite, which a lot of people probably don't use, which is gonna be the Bullfrog. I'm saying I love the Bullfrog. I used it. Oh yeah, I have like 10k plus kills with this thing. So my setup I ran was the GRU suppressor, the Task Force barrel, as NAS grip, the um 85 round mag, as mag, GRU elastic wrap, and the KGB skeletal stall. I'm saying I love the bullfrog, you know and I'm saying basically the bison from Modern Warfare last year. So yeah, this is definitely my favorite gun in this game. You know what I'm saying so um yeah. The next gun right here is the LC10. There's another gun that was a little OD when it first came out, and if I didn't nerf it to like start of a new season, I don't think, but it's still like you know, what I'm saying it's still good. So, class it up is the agency suppressor, the task force barrel, the um, saw fishing tool around fast mag, airborne elastic wrap, and the radar stock. So, definitely, LC10 one of my favorite guns. This is actually I'm gonna check right here, I'm gonna show you all. This is my most used gun right here. Was a look, almost 18k kills. Um, yeah, definitely love this thing a lot. Definitely use it a lot. But um, yeah. All right, but another setup. One of the gun is the um EM2. The EM2, mm, which is torches, torches, torches. I'm saying companies are DLC weapons, but DLC weapons seem to be the OD ones. So for the EM2 was the Markoflex LED, the SoCal Eliminator, the Task Force Barrel, the Agent Grip. The stand at 40 round mag, airborne elastic wrap, and the radar stock. So, I don't need to actually they get nerf with um task force and the they nerfed the overall damage on it. But I used it recently and it, it's actually pretty good. No cap, I ain't gonna lie, I think it's actually good. It's still one of the best ARs in the game, wild gun majority of the ARs. So, um, now for the last gun is going to be all right, so it's the AK, as you can see, right? AK is, you know what I'm saying? It's been good in every game it's ever been in. AK is definitely one of the best ARs in this game. Oh, by far, I got G8 in um, League, so. The class setup is the Microflex LED, the um, KGB Eliminator, the Spaznaz RPK Barrel, the Spaznaz Grip, Foot Around Bag, GRU Elastic Wrap, and the KGB Skeletal Stalk. You know what I'm saying? So, AK is definitely one of those best guns in the game. I have like. I think I have 10k kills with this, at least over 10k, I think, for sure. The AK 11k kill today, the 4k, you know what I'm saying? AK is just, just a lovely gun, even though I don't like it in Modern Warfare, but it's definitely one of the best ARs in here. But, um, yeah, so these are the top five guns in Cold War overall, you know what I'm saying? Um, Vanguard comes out in a couple of days, in like two days, all of me. Alright, drop a like in the video, subscribe to the channel if you know.